Hi there and welcome back to Shadowrun Returns. I'm Byron and we are still in the Universal Brotherhood and apparently have made our way into the Inner Sanctum. I don't like how the turret looks at me. This door will take you to the Inner Sanctum of the Universal Brotherhood. If you have not retrieved your team yet, you will be unable to do so past this point. Do you wish to proceed? Yes, because I have retrieved my team. Thank you. Beneath the Brotherhood, past the door is a short passage leading to a freight elevator. You hit the down button and the elevator rumbles its descent. Past where a basement would be, past where a parking garage would be. The door is open to a very different environment from the one you left. Gun is the airy, soothing atmosphere of the Brotherhood's public face. Okay, they let the mask drop here. The corridor leading from the elevator is uti utilitarian and sterile, the spa music replaced by echoing nothingness. Somewhere ahead, far below the Universal Brotherhood, is Sam's twin sister. Somewhere ahead, beneath the veneer of unity and belonging, is Sam's killer, the same woman, Jessica Watts. Yes, please move on. Okay, we have to find out what happened to Shane for Sherry Bomb. We got three more karma. That means we are done. We have 12 now. That should be enough to go to Willpower 10. Exactly. So, well. Hold it. Uh, hmm. Quick save, I have a bad feeling. Fulfill your purpose. Uh, what? Oh shit. According to the cops' ID badge, you found Shane. He doesn't look too good. And a basic med kit, why not? Hi mom and dad, I hope you guys are doing great and you aren't having any more problems with the neighbor's dog. Sorry it's been so long since I wrote, but once you reach my level you need to reduce your exposure to the corrupting influences of our world and that means all metrics and comlink access. I don't know when this will get to you. They say that we will no longer need our data pads anymore when we go get to the next level. I thought I would jot it down here and ask one of the higher level brothers and sisters to pass this along. Be sure to send them a thank you note when you get this. I don't know when I can visit you next. My time here is important. Not just for me, but for the coming age of peace and prosperity the, bro prosperity the brotherhood will bring for us all. Yours, Jenny. Hmm, Jenny is probably dead too. Man, there are a bunch of stupid people. It says members only there. Guess we have to get in there. Hi, who's that? A Brotherhood Guard. There's another door here. Let's check that door. Hey, what do we get? An advanced med kit. Um, we'll send this item to your stash. Maybe for the next run then. That's pretty much all we can do here. I guess we have to talk to the Brotherhood Guard. We want to progress any further. Let's do that. No way to reform up here just in case things go sour. Sorry, that's as far as you go. Don't worry, all the Brotherhood's mysteries will be revealed in time. Now please step away. I have learned so much, I can't stop now. Stand aside, my friend, our enlightenment awaits. 
Hey, I have not seen you in the briefing sheets. Wait, I've never seen you, any of you here before. He reaches for his weapon. Oh, really? So, well, yeah, he reaches for his weapon. And Caprice is gonna stun somebody. You. Landed. So, well, well, you could, and you actually have a uh, haste. Very good. You cast it on Caprice. So, you can actually have two more action points. That's amazing. That means you cast a lightning bolt. I didn't do much. And an asset stream. Okay. Hmm. So, well, you could use a name chart. I didn't do as much as I hoped it would. Missed. Not good. damage and we still have you and you activate your friendly drone gotcha oh, well that's not really much move ahead So, well, you could try to shoot. 32 is not much and you miss. Whatever. Um, yeah, Raccoon Toad. Oh, no. Maybe not. Um, just... Move up a bit. We can't do shit because, well, <laughs> let's uh, get close and drill you. Twenty damage. Maybe a lightning bolt. And just a regular shot. I didn't do much. Doesn't matter really. So if you you could move up here, that will give you not enough. Moving closer, right next to him. Still only 65, but it's enough. Uh, why doesn't combat end? There are two doors. You also move close to the storm. And that's it. Okay, we end the turn. Moving close. Why the fuck are you so far away? So, um, what did your totem do? The power of Raccoon aids friends within a range of 3 with plus 2 move. Last two rounds. Nice. So I guess you open the door and well, there's nothing in there.
A Cavalier's midline frag grenade. Would you like to do with it? Send it to your stash. And another frag grenade. Fine. That's apparently all we can do. So, come on, girl. Okay, we have to move up here. Ah, stupid. And the turn. Maybe you should move a bit to the side. You should move ahead. Let's position our party well. And the turn. You cast another raccoon thingy. What else do you have? Lightning barrier haste. Could cast another haste on. Well, I don't really know whether this is necessary. Let's open the door and see what's on the other side. You're not supposed to be here. It is necessary. Cast another haste on Caprice. So, uh, we have whatever that is a Brotherhood follower and another Brotherhood follower. I don't like the sign of that. Still think we will take out one of you. With blindness. Blinded. And a flamethrower on you. And well, I guess a lightning bolt on you. So um, you are next. Can you hit? Oh, that's not enough. There's really no coverage you can get within one. With the movement of one doesn't matter. I hope we. Hey, get me out of here! Oh, we shall see. Let's see whether we can take you out. Why did that thing move two spaces? That's annoying as fuck. You only move one. And you start shooting. Thanks, exactly. Might as well shoot this one too. Um... Yeah, you move next to him. Why not? And file. No! He had two. I don't get it. He had two. Fuck you. Yeah, I help you. Don't get your pennies up in a bunch. A UB holding cell key. Bad. What do we have to do here? Well, there's another door here. Can you open it? Yes, you can. What's in here? Searching the desk. You find a list of money transferred made by the Brotherhood. Not too bad. And uh, there seems to be a door here that I can't open, and there is probably a spirit that we could summon. And the turn. What do you get in here? Nothing really. So so far I haven't made uh, 
well, the best experiences with summoning um, spirits. What do we get here? Nothing apparently. Well, we could try and take a look at the spirit, right? <laughs> it's another apocalypse. Oh well. It's probably gonna turn on us sooner than later. Turn the drone off. So, I don't know. I want to regroup first. Before we open that cell. And the turn. Open the thingy. What now? Marie Louise, the young elf woman, is clearly shaking from being locked up and seeing her jailer killed in front of her eyes. The, these people are insane. I've been a prisoner all night and I heard noises. She shudders. Relax, you're safe now. What's your name? She sighs, coming down off the adrenaline rush. Marie, Marie Louise, listen, we've got to get out of here. The priests and acolytes have been going down that hole since they locked me up. And they were chanting all the way, but then I heard screaming and something else, something foul. Did you see a woman here, blonde, human, early 40s maybe? You mean Jessica? Yes, she's here somewhere. She and my aunt are together. My aunt brought me here. She said the brotherhood was just what I needed. That I could find a new family here like she did. That I could be part of something bigger than myself. Then it got weird. You'd expect people like this to be nice to you, you know? That's what they're all about. But this was different. They all started bowing to me. And that's when the chanting started. That's when I got really scared. Okay, time to go. I guess yeah, <laughs> you were supposed to be the, you know, the sacrifice. Oh, hi. Marie Louise, what do you think you're doing? What does it look like? No, you're needed here. There's a hungry glint in Jessica's eyes. I'll bet. I won't be your sacrificial lamp, Jessica. My darling girl, you misunderstand. What we offer is eternal life, a chance to be a part of a new... Jessica suddenly notices you and her words fail in her throat. You... you're alive? <laughs> well, it isn't eternal life, but it will do. <laughs> she composes herself, so you say. But I'm glad you're here. Truly I am. You've helped me more than you can know. Further opened my already wide eyes. I thought I understood my feelings towards Sam. I thought I knew why I needed to put him and my old life behind me. But Sam represented so much more. This world is sick, you see. Humanity is sick. And perhaps better than anyone, Sam embodied that sickness. He cared nothing for others. He barely cared for himself. Self-destruction. It was Sam's path. And it is humanity's path if we don't make a change. If we don't embrace a new way of thinking. We must put each other first. And this is the basis of my new family. You're sure you're not just putting yourself first? The last savage act I committed was to bury my mother, and even that was done in service of cleansing myself so that I can serve my new family without distraction. There is a new world coming, Caprice, and it's beautiful, ordered, safe, unambiguous, un unambiguous, a world where everyone knows their place. Imagine it. A world without chaos, without selfishness, or any other human failings. No one to betray you or hurt you or... 
Jessica, well, she doesn't need help. She's a killer. She needs a bullet to the brain. Listen to yourself. You don't even sound human anymore. Soon I won't be. I will transcend, becoming part of something bigger than myself. She smiles a wicked smile. But first, I think it's time you met my new family. They're eager to make your acquaintance. Like fuck. X fucking cues me. True form worker, the creature makes a mangled sound of chittering and human agony. Holy crap. Don't be afraid, darling girl, no one will hurt you. You are our queen. She locked us in, but I can't I can get us out of here. Last night they were holding me in the next room, the one with the computers. I jacked into one and was hacking the security system when I tripped the alarm and got caught. They threw me in that cell and disabled the jackpot, but I can fix them. We'll help you fix the jackpots. Look, I went to the best school in the country for matrix engineering. I know what I'm doing. They locked the notes down when they caught me, but I slipped in some code before they did. So it has to be me that jacks in. Just hold them off and let me fix it. What about intrusion countermeasures? I ride ice as a hobby, okay? Just trust me and keep that thing away from me. How entertaining! I'm glad you weren't killed at the cemetery, Caprice. It will be much more fun to watch you die. Okay, we have to defend her. <sighs> Let's see, what do we have? Robert Follower. They seem to have melee weapons. They don't have melee weapons. Oh, there's my apoco apocalypse, it's still here. So you cast a haste on the priest. So I think we wanna stun this one. Landed. So, um, I say we start shooting. Oops. Okay. Out of ammo. Boo. Um. Okay. You move over here, and you start attacking. Missed. That worked. That worked too. So, Capri is my love. How about you grill this one? Exactly. You activate your drone. And it should get a little closer. And start shooting. You have a pistol, but no range. But he could get a little closer. Oh, 94. Well, whatever. So, Caprice, you're still in business. I like that. Flamethrower. 20 damage. Very nice. Acid stream. And a regular attack. And maybe another one. Oh, really? Fine. Thank 
Thank you. Now you. Um. You could try to get some cover. No, just keep shooting at it. It's still blind. Great. Oh well. Try to get a little closer. Uh, that actually took down the hit probability. That's kind of weird. If you get closer, the hit probability goes down. Really? That's. Oh no, it's you actually. Okay, I thought it was the drone. What can you do? I guess you just attack them. Uh, actually, I'd rather banish you. No use to fight a uh, war on two fronts. Where the fuck did you come from? Pure insect spirit. Really? Immune. Okay. <sighs> Not good. Start shooting. Okay, that didn't work. How about you? Missed. How about a lightning bolt? And regular check. So, um, let's see, you could take cover here. You could shoot? And then take cover here. The thing is, I don't seem to be able to help them. Could what do we have? Could summon a uh, fire elemental. Why not? There, now you see them in their truest form. Now you see that they cannot die. Oh. 
What the hell are these things? They are the immortal soul made flesh. They are our destiny. Are you blind, woman? These are giant bugs. Open your mind, Caprice. They are so much more than you think. My mind was open to her when she called from beyond the veil, and she has rewarded my service and my faith with great power. This could have been yours as well, Marie Louise. You were to be host for our queen, but no matter. There is another. Okay. So we have to actually enter the matrix. But we will do that in the next video. Marie Louise. <laughs> we will do it in the next video. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.